I have to read this page from a book my mom sent me because when I tell y'all this shit is so simple but so good, if this resonates with you, listen to it before you go to bed or when you wake up in the morning and I promise you, it's so good. All the things that you think are wrong with you are more than likely the very things that make you perfect for who you are meant to be and what you are here on earth to do. The late, messy, disorganized, loud, intense, anxious, emotional, slightly lazy, absent-minded, hot mess that I am has allowed me to be the passionate, innovative, creative, bold as fuck, figure it out, open-minded, deeply caring, way out of the box, work smarter, not harder, watch me do it my way, make it happen now, hot mess that I needed to be for my career to become what it has. I spent my whole early life trying to change things about myself that turned out to be my biggest strengths. But the answer was never to restrict myself, fight myself, or change myself. The answer was to embrace myself and to allow everything about me to be used to my advantage. Let's be clear. God did not fuck up when he made us or when he gave us our desires. However, we are all human and we have all created less than functional ways of operating in a world that feels unsafe. So I'm just saying, if you are like going through it and life is hitting you like boom, 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 bam, because life is hard. Like we all are very aware, like this shit is very ghetto. We are all just taking it one step at a time, one day at a time, doing the best we can, being delusional, whatever it is. There's nothing wrong with you. And I truly believe whether it's God or the universe or ancestors or spirit, or if you believe in nothing, whatever it is that you hold on to that keeps you in a peaceful state of mind life will work for us if we allow it to it's just the believing it part that can get kind of difficult especially when life is like girl fuck you well guess what bitch i'm gonna be good